please subscribe and ring the bell to never miss an update. Hello everyone, happy holiday season. It's that time of year when we're looking for great gifts, tabletop essentials, and seasonal decor. Today on Lady Mary Bath, I'm taking you inside the MAM Resales Holiday Store Reset. Join me. It's a winter welcome at one of our favorite charity resales. There's always something exciting to discover and we get to see it before the doors open, including the perfect Christmas angel. They do a great job with their displays and they also have some great kid items. Most of these are brand new, including the Christmas socks and bows. Aren't they adorable? You get the perfect gift and it's affordable. Welcome to MAM Resales Holiday Edition of the Store Reset. It is the perfect time of the year to shop resale for tabletop essentials and great gifts. I'm already finding something wonderful with a Linux holiday tray for $10. Let's take a look at the store. You'd be amazed at the new in-box items you find here at MAM, including the Spode Christmas Tree Travel Mug, priced at $12 and perfectly packaged. They also have lots of florals and winter picks that you could add to some crystal vases, a Victorian Santa. You could place him just about anywhere in your home, including under the tree, priced at $14. I like this red box, sort of like a chest, and that could be a riser for some Christmas decor, including for a small tree, $3.50 for this Christmas tree in a box. That's a fun kid activity with pop-ups. Just never know what you'll find here, including some stockings. You could also embroider names on these. Lots of fun things. The stockings are hung by the chimney with care in hopes that great thrifted items would be there. And this store is truly full of treasures. I see some amazing things here waiting for us. Let's go take a look. I usually head straight to housewares, but the seasonal shelving area has some great holiday items. It's always worth a look. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. This elf actually holds bottles of wine for $5.50. Add your favorite bubbly for a great gift or simply as a carrying tote for your holiday parties. These towels are from the Hallmark store and they would be great hostess gifts. You could pair that with other items as well. Two tea towels and a wooden spoon. Joy and glory to the newborn king. And we have a matching pair. You could definitely balance out a mantle or tabletop with these. Or you have a pair of great gifts. I love tartan plaid and I'm thinking this could come in handy. The scarf ribbon retails for $12.99. One is brand new in a package, the other is missing it. And here we've got some Pimpernel for $4.50. These are made in England and they're great coasters. For $5, that trio would be perfect on a table. Now let's take a look at the pops of color here with a punch bowl. The ever popular carnival glass. You see that iridescent sheen. I've shared in previous segments how they achieve this. It's quite an interesting process. Price is $79 for this set. And that color is spectacular. A pop of color that I could see from across the room. One of my favorite tabletop essentials, the Party Perfect Punch Bowl. If you shopped Kmart or Woolworths in the 1970s, you would have seen this Party Perfect Punch set boxed with the seven quart punch bowl 
12 cups, 12 hooks, and one ladle for the price of $7.77. It was made in this lime green along with blue and gold. And this, I think, is the best color because it goes with so many seasons. This could be for St. Patrick's Day, anytime in spring, summer, fall, and especially for Christmas, you see with a pop of red. It is the perfect look for your table. A close-up view of those punch cups. You'll see the iridescent effect there with the carnival glass. I just love this. I'm glad that it's becoming more popular and this is highly collectible today. The Indiana Glass Company of Dunkirk, Indiana is well known for its contemporary carnival glass production. This launched in the 1970s. It is the harvest pattern, often referred to as harvest grape. And that is during the time period when carnival glass experienced a resurgence. I would love to hear from you in the comments below if you have some creative uses for punch cups. And I'll tell you all about a wonderful use that my friends Mark and Cooper have recently shared with me at a fabulous dinner. If I had more space, I would take this home. A punch set is versatile. You could use the punch bowl as a centerpiece with red ornaments inside that would look great in the lime green, place a poinsettia, and that would be a very easy way to achieve a holiday look. Of course, the punch cups can be used separately. This is great for fruit cup, strawberries Romanoff with brunch. And I was recently invited to a friend's birthday dinner and he served corn chowder in his grandmother's punch cups. That was special. I've also seen these as chandeliers, believe it or not. You could also place these on a Christmas tree with something fun inside and do lots with a punch set. They do have a nice assortment of silver plate, and I've even found sterling silver on occasion mixed in on these shelves. This vintage meat platter catches my eye. You will see the tree of life, all the natural juices drained from the branches into that drain well. For a bold look, this abstract art glass would be just the right addition for your modern decor. And I love the contrast with those colors very unique. Let's take a look at this. Normally would hold a glass insert. You could even use the base to elevate a centerpiece. This lid actually does not fit the Revere bowl. I think it must have gotten mixed up, but the bowl is definitely something practical that you could even pour a candle into it. I think it should be called the Four Seasons Punch Set. It is absolutely perfect. And I see some other things here that are definitely getting my attention, including this aqua. Have you ever thought about adding this color to Christmas? Just love that turquoise aqua shade. For $10, this open lattice compote would be a wonderful addition. And if you're getting one, then you should probably consider getting the smaller relish dish that has that traditional daisy and button design that is EAPG, Early American Pattern Glass. Aqua pairs well with red for the holiday season. And for a 1950s vintage Christmas look with touches of pink, that would be fun. I also like it with green for year round. It's a very soothing look. Also a bit coastal. That would be even a good beach theme for Christmas. And I think my favorite would be with silver. And that way you can segue into the new year. Great possibilities with this aqua glass. This stoneware serving piece is always a welcome addition to my tabletop collection. I've got quite a few different pieces in this design. And I'm just thrilled to find it for such a deal. $10. It's a bottom shelf advantage with this Nora Fleming three-part dish. This is a retired piece in their pearled pattern, and I've seen it for $70 and up on the secondary market. Of course, when you add shipping, that does increase the cost. And this is $10 today. What a great gift opportunity. And you'll see there's a hole in the corner, and that is for placing the collectible minis. And they retail for about $15. My newest mini is a chinoiserie ginger jar. This would be great for a beverage bar, hot cocoa bar. You could place even items in here for your baked potato toppings. It could segue from tabletop to the vanity and even desk. 
follow me on social media and you will see how I use these beautiful Nora Fleming pieces with the minis. And a basic staple for any tabletop collection. Picture Perfect, another great holiday entertaining essential and a great gift. This is Anchor Hawking's Prescott pattern. It is known as EAPC, Early American Prescott Glass. It launched in 1960. Anchor Hawking developed a state-of-the-art manufacturing process that enabled them to produce a wide variety of pressed glass items quickly and inexpensively. I invite you to take a look at a previous segment where I share my picture collection and ways that I utilize these. Now it's time to get into the holiday spirit with some traditional decor and brass accents. Definitely an easy way to liven up your space and keep watching social media in the coming days. I will share with you how I have showcased some of these items in my holiday decor. And there's a familiar pattern here you have seen in dishware that we now see in glassware. I set a table at the Charity Guild shop recently with this beautiful holiday pattern. There are many possibilities beyond the bookshelf with these brass bookends. This stately pair would be perfect for the holiday season, fall and Christmas. These can be used on either side of a centerpiece to anchor your table. And of course, you could use them separately or together. Even on a table or a bookshelf, you could place them at different heights. And you could also have some fun with these by embellishing, hanging something from the antlers. You could attach bows, bells, anything that your holiday heart desires. Add holiday charm to your gatherings with some festive spode Christmas tree goblets. These are absolutely fantastic, made by the Libby Glass Company. They retail for $40 for a box set of four. They are 22 karat gold banded, and that is something you could easily pair with white dishes. If you don't want Christmas dishes, this would be a lovely addition. And let's see how much these are today. $1 each, what a deal. And the manufacturer will tell you these are not dishwasher safe because of potential cloudiness, but it's actually more related to the gold band and the screen print design. You'll want to hand wash these beauties. The brass candle holders are actually very well priced. Some of these are $10, $20. And if you've ever looked in retail stores or even antique shops, you will see that these are actually very affordable here. So many great ways to utilize these, and a collection always tells a better story. So don't buy just one. And the styles can certainly blend well together. And some that have one of my favorite styles that I usually see in furniture. A new twist on candlesticks. Brass candle holders are a great investment for your tabletop. The warm tones work well for fall and Christmas. They've got a great selection here in the store. Ruby Cut to Clear is always calling my name. This is a bit unusual to incorporate an egg into your holiday decor, but I think the color is right and that can be an item of interest. And you can bring it out again in the spring. And it was priced at $20. A good egg and a great find with this ruby cut to clear crystal. Isn't that a fantastic piece? And it has the sticker that says made in Poland, 24% lead crystal. This you could actually incorporate it into your holiday decor. Great decor for your front porch or entryway with this wooden snowman featured next to a lantern. You could carry him throughout the month of January, priced at $28.50. Vintage canisters are highly collectible and these apples are fun. The largest one is priced at $38. And that would actually be a great feature for fall. You can incorporate these into any decor. It doesn't have to just be used in the kitchen. And you've got a good cookie jar too. Blue and white is full of delight. And we have some interesting features here. England, Russia, and the Netherlands are represented all on one shelf. Let's have a closer look at all of these elements. Lots to see here, including those KLM houses. 
that was a gift in first class. These are highly collectible and they do have the entire collection featured in Amsterdam at the airport priced at $10 each. Those are fun. Sometimes I see these in antique stores. The signature collection from Spode. This is a limited edition priced at $28. Love that plate. Some Linux metalware and quite a collection of those Russian dolls. Other chinoiserie. And we're going to have a look at the back stamp. This is not something that I've actually seen before. Someone had a large collection that they donated to ma'am, handmade in Russia. And they are priced individually for about $10. You could certainly just add a few to a collection, feature on a shelf. A very unusual find today. And we've got the perfect package. I just love all these items and I have some creative ideas for these. This one is from Shannon Crystal. And I love a red bow. Dresses up any package and here it's integrated and makes your gifting even easier. So many ideas here. And you certainly don't want to shop retail when you see the possibilities. A glass Santa platter for $4. Put some cookies on this, gift it to a friend or a neighbor, and you've got a great gift. And wonderful gift packaging right here with this glass box, and you've already got a bow on it. Silver-plated teapots and coffee pots are perfect for floral centerpieces. Keep that in mind, especially if you are going to an event site. You don't have to worry about breakage and can't get enough of these. Vintage glass is always a good option if you're trying to build a centerpiece or looking for serveware. These cake plates are vintage and affordable. Santa Paws and Mrs. Claus. We have a pet corner here. If you're trying to build a pet themed tree or find a gift, maybe even a hostess gift. If you know that they have a beloved pet would certainly be an option. And it's something a little bit more practical. This tree is calling me love the vivid colors and the price is unbelievable the christmas section does not disappoint a 3d fabric tree is a fun addition to your christmas and it is kid friendly these were very popular in the 70s i think all of our moms probably made these i have a small collection myself and i have one placed under my christmas tree that adds some depth and interest and you could certainly embellish these with bows or bells on the branches. This is well priced at $2.50. The seasonal section is full of great ideas, including a Texas table we see with Merry Christmas, y'all. A Melissa and Doug reindeer that is a showstopper. Have some ideas for him. And of course, we've got the Grinch. A lot of people collect him and Snoopy. You never know what you'll find here, including man's best friend. I think he will sell rather quickly. It's just amazing the fantastic items that they can bring in. An advent calendar for $8 you could fill with your favorite finds. Perhaps a sweet treat. and even some collegiate items here with Texas A&M, LSU, and the Tennessee Vols. Of course, UT, University of Texas. We've got some Aggies in our family and my stepsister and her husband are Tennessee Vols. In fact, her grandparents wrote Rocky Top. There's Mississippi State. I'm gonna take this home and bring that to Tennessee for Christmas. They are bringing out more ornaments as the store opens. We've got some great options here already. And of course the price is right. And you even find some personalized ornaments with initials. That pink pineapple is interesting. Let's take a closer look. I probably should have taken this one home since I love pineapples. 
Many of us are invited to holiday parties with an ornament exchange this time of year. And why shop retail for the cost and the crowds when you can thrift that ornament? This one is perfectly packaged for $6.50 and they have a great assortment and they start at about $2 each. And here's our Merry Christmas Y'all Corner, one of the favorite words we use here in Texas. You could create a tree around every single ornament. I probably should have taken all of these home, but I do have quite a few trees already. We're very proud of our Lone Star State. But I did take this one home. I happen to really like anything cross-stitch. Those blue bonnets are nice. Our state flower. And of course the cowboy hat, very fitting. And the armadillo. I do like Christmas books and I will share some ideas that I have and ways that I incorporate these into decor. The Santa Mouse takes me back to childhood. This 12 Days of Christmas pop-up book is such fun. Wouldn't that be the perfect gift for a child? And you're not breaking the bank. Don't overlook the books. This is one that I had as a child. It's a classic. I use Christmas books as risers, as you probably have seen in my holiday home tour. I have three on my breakfast server with a Santa lamp on top. And another idea, if you just want to shop your home and not add some more books, is to shop your bookshelf and pull some books based on size and height. And you can even wrap them in Christmas paper and bundle them with a holiday ribbon. And that could be used as part of your centerpiece or in a side table as a plateau or riser. The ornaments actually start at 50 cents each. This snowman would be the perfect package tie to add to a ribbon. And you could slip in a gift card in the back pocket. This one's definitely going home with me. An angel to top your tree or to add to your decor. Doesn't have to be used for the intended purpose. And you can find a variety of these in store to fit your style and colors. It's always worth a look in the cases. I find some top brands for at least half of retail. The Waterford Crystal oversized balloons are $60 each, and these are about $175 and up retail and a much better quality with the classic Waterford than what you can buy today. The wines and goblets are $48 each, which is less than half of retail. The Gorham Nativity with the gold accents, priced at 75, it's made in Germany. And you will see this set in our German holiday home tour coming up soon on the channel. And it's one that I actually already had. I didn't purchase it in store today. I found mine at shopgoodwill.com. And the willow tree, also highly collectible. I just can't get enough of the Waterford, especially the quality that you just don't find anymore. Look at that sparkle and shine. And that is quite an extensive collection that they are offering in store. And these are not stocked either. It's harder to find. $18 for this violet vase with the Alana cuts. I bought this same vase here for $3 recently. 18 is still a very fair price and a great gift. Costa Boda, Waterford number one, which is a great gift. I've talked about that in a previous segment here. And more holiday items. Even if your budget is $5, you could find something great. Look, this Christmas platter is $3. You could add some homemade cookies to that, tie a ribbon around it, got a great gift. Very festive. These would be great for January as well. Doesn't have to just be for Christmas. $19.95 original retail, $6 for this mistletoe. I do remember some of the upscale designer stores selling these. You can even place that on a tree. Doesn't have to just be in a doorway. This pottery trio is interesting. 
$16 for that first piece. So many possibilities with these. The Linux Hurricane Lamp, it actually fits a tea light candle and that can be placed on a breakfast table, tea time. It is the Winter Greeting, priced at $28. I recently attended a private event at Bluebird Circle and the plates were Winter Greetings. That was fun. And some other decorative objects here. And Fitz and Floyd, brand new in a box. They give you a comparative price. Amazon is almost $23, and this is $11. Again, another great gifting opportunity. You can't go wrong with brand new in a box. A cookie jar. Another great hostess gift. This snowman is fun. And you could even carry that into the new year. And it's from Hallmark for $5. The set of mugs for $8. And the ribbon holly pattern from Mikasa. And that's Bone China. Hand-painted Russian bells, $18 each. Well, someone had quite an extensive collection of Russian items. These are fantastic. Baldwin Brass, very well-known company, $8 for this ornament, and as you can see, it's pretty in a package. Here are some of those floral picks. I think that's such fun to add to a tree or even a vase. You could add fresh flowers and then have a couple of these iced twigs that are $7.50 each, and that gives you a winter look. And it's something, of course, that's lasting. I'm always looking for Christmas pillows. And this one is interesting. It's more of a knitted style. And it's in reference to Twas the Night Before Christmas, written by my ancestor. Not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. And it's very well priced, $10. And one thing that I'm looking for when considering a pillow is that it should have a zipper so that you can open that and wash the cover. And this one fits the bill. That angel stocking is really neat. Probably should have bought that. And here's a closer look at the brand new in a box. Bless this home from Linux Holiday. I can fill my cart with some Christmas gifts. Have to have that tree and the Santa Mouse book, and these two great ornaments. You know I'm taking home this Spode de Chinoiserie. This will be a base for a centerpiece. Limited edition. Oh, I could hang it on a wall. We'll see what I end up doing with that. The Cut to Clear Ruby Egg, have to take that home. And of course the Nora Fleming to go with all of my minis. The Deer. Yes, I have actually since placed these on my entry table and I will share that on my social media accounts coming up soon. And here's my Christmas haul. So glad you joined me today for Ma'am Resell's Holiday Store Reset. We found some great items, some bargains, and some wonderful tabletop additions as well to make your holiday entertaining easy. Thanks again for joining Lady Mary Bath. Elevate your everyday with charity resale shopping.